Dr. Alex is back. Yep. I just wanted you to take a look at what we got going on back here. We had triplets. We yeah. had triplets before. But let's talk about the cycle, how long it takes for them to have babies. Spring is a very common time for um, any of our small ruminants, goats, sheep, um, to have babies because they're short day cyclers, so their, their breeding season comes in as the, the days become shorter. So commonly September, October is their most common breeding season. Uh, then they have a 150 day gestation, so about five months, which carries them into the spring, um, you know, which, which is advantageous for the mothers with grass coming on to you know, uh, kind of bounce back from having babies and, and then the babies to figure out what grass is and to start eating. We need some grass, it's about time. Yeah, it is about time. You know, you look over here, and, and what's funny is, is the ram that came in here, man, he was a hoss. Mm -hmm. I mean, he was a hoss. Solid white, see solid white. She's got a little coloration, but look what we got over here. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty interesting. I mean, to see as much color in that little male um, as he has is, is pretty wild. I mean, like you said, she's got a little coloring. She's got some freckling on her legs, especially as you get you know, down toward her hooves, you can see some darker hairs, but obviously nothing like that little guy has. Good looking, so pretty cool. good looking outfit, isn't it? Yeah. So what's your overall thoughts about this? Uh, looking good? Yeah, they all look really good. I mean, you know, we've been standing here watching them for a few minutes and everybody is vigorously nursing. Um, they're wagging those tails and, and kind of bouncing around like they should. Now, at what point do we need to start thinking about um, what are the next steps? Do they need any kind of immunization? Do they need any kind of worming or anything? When, when do you start thinking about that? So uh, most people, if they're, if, as far as deworming goes, um, a lot of people will deworm about a month before the mother gives birth because they're going to pick up their parasites from her or other herd mates. Right. They, you can deworm them. A lot of times people will do that at the end of their immunization series. Uh, most common thing that we vaccinate sheep for is a CDT vaccine, which is Clostridium perfringens type C and D and tetanus is in that. Four to six weeks is about when they would get their first vaccine. Gotcha. And then three to four weeks after the first one, they get a booster. The only other thing would be on the males. Obviously, a lot of people um, would prefer to have uh, a castrated male to eat rather than that testosterone taint to the meat. Banding is, is the most common way to take care of that with lambs. Some people will do that within a couple of days of hitting the ground. Most people, you know, just from a standpoint of handling them as few times as possible and being efficient, will do that at the first round of vaccinations. Right. You know, as far as a basic health check on these guys, you know, when I first pick them up, eyes, meaning their, you know, the brightness in their eyes as well as mucous membrane color, and I'll show you how to look at that in a second. So the best place to check those mucous membranes are actually to roll that bottom eyelid down, and you can see it just bulges that tissue out. Nice and pink, almost, you know, That's red. Yeah, yeah, it looks great, it looks really good. Umbilicus, so making sure that this is, you know, dry a couple days out, um, and there's no swelling. So everything's sealed off, you know, no, basically no, no entry point for disease. Right. Everything's sealed up there. And then joints are kind of the big ones. So, and then all of his joints look good. You know, we, we saw him running around in there. Doesn't look like he's limping, but it doesn't hurt to, you know, feel around each of those joints, make sure nothing's swollen. So, but yeah, he looks really looks good. good. I mean, it feels like he's fattening up on mama's milk pretty quick. So what do we get grade-wise today? A plus. Everybody a looks plus. good. A plus. I like good, that. Yeah. It's the first one I ever got in my life. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs>